The collapse of two big banks has left some people worried about their money. Now, questions are swirling and fears are growing. Brandon Lewis verifies if your money is safe. The number of people searching for an answer to the question, should I pull my money out of the bank, spiked over the last few days following the collapse of Silicon Valley and Signature Banks. So is your money safe at the bank? Let's verify. Our sources are the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation, the Federal Reserve, and Associate Dean David Eli with San Diego State University's Fowler College of Business. Almost all banks pay the FDIC for insurance. This ensures that in the unlikely event of a bank failure, deposits under $250,000 per account holder are protected. This applies to checking, savings, and money market accounts, certificates of deposit, cashier's checks, money orders, and negotiable order of withdrawal, or now accounts. So yes, if you have less than $250,000 in each account, your money is safe, and there's nothing to worry about. If you have more than the limit, then Eli suggests spreading your money to different types of accounts, since each one is protected up to $250,000. So why were people panicking after SVB collapsed? Nine in 10 account holders at the bank had more than $250,000 in their accounts, meaning they were largely uninsured until the FDIC stepped in and said they would protect all of their money. With your Verify, I'm Brandon Lewis. If there's something you'd like the Verify team to check out, you can email verify at 12newsnow.com or message us on social media.